we're in a train station, our train is late for six hours, but it's okay because in India there's special platforms and application where you can uh, search for delay of your train and we saw it already so we didn't wait uh, here in the train in the railway station for six hours we started directly from the hostel knowing that it will be late and now we're here there's a separation between uh, classes and uh, if you have upper class so there is a glass protected uh, waiting rooms for those people like uh, VIP and for others there is just, just railway station interesting and let's see uh, soon we'll see how it's inside in the trains and we'll see for what uh, uh, thing the Gandhi was fighting for I already said that the Indian trains are late but I didn't say that actually you don't know from which platform they will on which platform they will come because the tableau and the small uh, screens in a train station they're, they're they're not real and they're false they're lying because now we the the guy who's working there he said that our train is late and it will come on the fourth platform then we came to the first platform and there is a screen which is telling that it's, it's, uh, it's coming now and going away also now so we're late we come another screen says that it's not late but we, we are not late but it will come soon like 10 minutes so we need to hurry up and in the first platform there's nothing there's no trains you're saying what's happening then you search for application and application says you that actually it's second platform you go to the second and ask the people and they say we don't know and some of them say that it's fourth platform so I came back to the worker asked what's happening and and they're not they're not uh, they're not in time to change the screens and now on the main screen there is like that the train will come in in one hour from the first platform. What the hell? Да, дело в том, что он с четвертой платформы будет через час. Я убью We are still waiting for the train. It does not come and we don't know on what platform it should be But they said that on this one but we're not sure tech, tech, We're not sure where's the train, where's the train uh -huh. Our first trial Indian train Not so cheap as we expected, 4 euros per person It is not the worst but the second worst class called sleeper class there is no AC and only thing which blows, besides your neighbor's breath, is an open window from which all sorts of salespeople or just beggars stick their hands and heads into it while train stops, yelling and annoying you. Непередаваемое туалетное зловоние встретило нас с распростертыми вагонными дверьми. За места здесь надо бороться, прямо как в очереди. Задремал, тут уже кто-то пристроился и сидит, облокачивается или ехидно поглядывает на твое место. Поэтому здесь работает правило. Попу поднял, место потерял. И пофиг, что у тебя есть билет. Толкайся и доказывай всем, если хочешь. Когда мы пришли на свои места, там уже сидело 6 человек, а мест по билетам там было, представьте, 6. И у нас билеты-то были. А значит, двое лишних тел были импостерами, едущими либо без билета, либо купившими билеты без мест. И теперь уютно теплившимся на наших местах. Но в процессе маршрута они таки аннигилировались, устыдившись вид, что отняли место у снизошедших богов. Кстати, поскольку в Индии бронировать место в поезде нужно за три недели до начала поездки, иначе мест не будет, мы взяли последние места. 
Скорее, через коррумпированного проводника нам помогли их взять, так как их уже не было. И как думаете, какие места нам достались? Возле туалета. И запах там был. Какой вы думаете? А до кучи в середине пути к нам ввалился какой-то маргинальный элемент, на это если красноречиво, а если нет, то... Человеком это существо можно было назвать едва ли. Завалившись на чужую койку без билета, он начал издавать рвотные потуги и непрерывно плеваться, то на другие койки, то на пол своей коричневой слюной, и периодически он что-то орал. Это была комбинация нездорового ума и наркотической интоксикации. Охраны и даже банального контролера в поезде нет, поэтому тело продолжало лежать на чужой койке и разлагать атмосферу вместе с пробегающими изредка тараканами. Конечно, было желание взять его за шкирку и выкинуть с поезда, но этого не произошло. Мы просто покинули свои места и нашли другие. Вот и правда, прямое следование принципу ненасилия Ахимсы, прямо как завещал Махатма Ганди. The train stops, it's dark, we pass huge factories, from which white smoke is pouring out as if something has exploded. This is a cane sugar factory. It looks like some kind of cyberpunk on a martial colony for collecting spices. Not the most pleasant experience, but we still just want to get to a safe place. Так, за нами приехало такси. Есть шанс добраться до места назначения. Выехав из города, мы оказались на проселочной дороге, уходившей в поля, джунгли и непроглядную тьму. А вокруг клубы тумана, как в фильмах ужаса. Кажется, где-то здесь затерялся очередной журналист, отправившийся расследовать какое-то странное дело в заброшенном семейном особняке или больнице, взяв с собой один лишь фонарик. Надеюсь, школа, в которую мы едем, обитаема. Today we are going to a voluntary work. Uh, yesterday we managed to get here with a taxi driver, so everything was fine. It was a, a very foggy weather yesterday and we were passing through the fog like in a desert movie and we didn't see nothing and uh, we used the car lights for that. It was a little bit scary because it was at the night and actually this village is located in nowhere. Uh, in the for in the foresty part or jungle part, uh, we didn't see it uh, yet, but the, uh, our host said so. And today we're going to a school for do some volunteer work. Normally we should paint the walls and then uh, draw uh, something on them, but we will see how it goes. It's only school in this village, and there is uh, 33 students in that school, so. Там была закрытая дверь, а веснушка думала, что это открытая. 
Не дальновидно. Идем дальше. Там корова есть. Это наша кухонька. Но не наша, а хозяйки, которые здесь готовят. Это вот что-то знак. А здесь открыто. Мистер Песик. Мистер Песик, здравствуйте. Hello, hello. Я не знаю, что это. Да, я Мистер Песик балуется. О, корова. Вау. Большое корова. А, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hello, how are you? Let's go. So this is our companions because we don't know where the school is located so we'll be going with them. Oh, Washington. Now we follow our companions, they lead us to the school, the director of which invited us to volunteer and paint the walls. He contacted us through couchsurfing. In return we were promised accommodation and food. We were given a separate room and local breakfast, lunch and dinner, which, by the way, were above all praise. Thank to the hostess Bobby for this. drawn by a Peru guy, Peru. They came and then they made, mm -hmm. I wanted outside, so they mm -hmm. made this one. And we need, I am telling you, uh, we need one uh, painting uh, this side also. Mm -hmm. Because I am thinking that... And here it is, the school itself. A two-floor building, but where the second floor is not yet operational. This is our new friend's private school. It stands on his plot of land with adjacent agricultural fields, where wood and cane are grown. This school concentrates on English language, and it is the only private school in the village. There are about 30 students studying here, but before Covid times there were more than 70. Shushil and Madam, another teacher, run this school together. Students study in a mixed order. In one class there are students of different ages who study from separate books and the teacher then checks the material learned. All subsequent drawings on the walls are drawings by volunteers from different countries. 
In the future, several of ours will be added to those drawings. The school is still under reconstruction and slowly developing. In the future it will be a large library, but for now equipment is stored here. Board for smiley board for children in a park and yes. and net volleyball also children they play I think it yeah. may be here and there somewhere. It's working but it is sometimes work sometimes it doesn't work. Yeah. <laughs> And yes, we have grass cutting machine also small. Uh -huh. ah, yes, so yes. I pen, uh, I saw some grass. We have speaker, this one, music uh -huh. system. Uh -huh. Yeah. Tomorrow uh, there will be some music here. Ah. Tomorrow, 3rd third, third, third December. Third December. Uh, all this is Sunday, but uh, every every year, yes. Uh, yeah, I think inside it will yes. be. Yeah. <laughs> 